The Cobras are in town. Did you make the squad? Let's find out. And before we officially unveil who made the squad, there's a lot of you guys that made this team, and there's a lot of you guys that made other teams in the league. In each episode, a different team will be shown, and different people that made those teams will be there also. But two things. One, if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing? I create lots of content, whether it's Super Mega Baseball, Madden, NBA 2K, sports games galore. Love to have you here as a subscriber. And two, as the very first episode in this series, I would love if we can hit a thousand likes or a thousand thumbs up on the episode. That would help out an absolute ton. And let's know that you guys want to see more of it too. So as for our team, we are the Cobras, as you kind of heard me say, and we are rocking sort of this neon green, black and white uniform combo. I think it looks kind of good. As for our roster, here's a look at essentially everybody that made our team. So you got Nick Payne, Trevor and Abnett, Uncle Joey, JW Clellan, uh, Mo Frazier, Tracy Jones, Justin D. Roberto, Rick Dingers, what an incredible name. I had to pick that one. Three Garb Strong, Zing Parks, Kurt Shepard, Obi-Wan. Another incredible name. And Tori Littlejohn. And as we go for our pitching staff, we got Tyler Morin, Dom Byrne, John Edwards, Nacho Taco. Probably the best name on the entire team, if we're being honest with it. Uh, Connor Griffin, Cole Jackson, Lamita Law, and Hingle McCringleberry. Shout out to Key and Peel. As for our starting lineup, here is a look at it. And I think we'll probably tweak this a little bit here and there. But overall... Let's jump into a game and see what we can do as a squad. Now we're kicking things off against these Swordfish and they are probably a much better overall team than we are. They got a lot more speed, their defense is kind of trash, but overall, they're a solid team. A tough opponent? Let's see what we got. It was a heads up, this is not a simulation game, but it kind of is a blend between simulation and arcade. There's a lot of things about it that are very difficult. It is not an easy game to play, but man, oh man, is it a rewarding one. And we're gonna be going through this entire series, see what we can do, we'll probably play I don't know, about 10-ish games uh, in the season. We'll simulate some and we'll ultimately see how it goes. But the goal is to try to win the equivalent of the World Series of the championship in this game. I'm kind of messing up the pitching a little bit, but we got a strikeout. Tyler Moore coming to play. Man, it was aggressive trying to break the bat. Okay, buddy. Up next is Dub Patrick. Let's see what he's got here. Nice little ball off the plate. Let's go uh, little two-seamer inside. Got that first strike. See if we can get here. Nice little curveball. Hits it right to Tariq Armstrong. Oh, Tariq's going to make an easy play, though. He's athletic. We'll take that. The next batter is Holly Nomskull. Okay. See what uh, Holly's got here. Now, this team only has about one or two players that are actually named. Again, I'll be adding people in the comments each episode. So if you want to play on any team, let me know your first and last name that you want your player to be, your best strength, and your worst strength, and then we'll kind of go from there. Up first for us is Tracy Jones. Power is not so great, but her contact and speed are incredible. Got a hold of one, and that one went about 7,000 feet up, and it's coming 7,000 feet down into their glove. Up next is Uncle Joey. Everyone probably has an Uncle Joey or knows an Uncle Joey in some way, shape, or form. He's going to hit one foul over there in left field. Going up against Tommy Watkins here. So in the heat. We got here in the third one. Okay, you know what? It didn't go as high as Tracy's, but it's still going to be an out. And then J.W. Cleland or Cleland is going to be up here. This man's got a whole lot of power. Can he do anything with it is the question. First is going to be a ball. Second one's looking like it's going deep. That one's going back. That one's looking like it might be out of here, baby. Look at the flick of the wrist. Always trust a man that's holding a baseball bat. We're in a full man, too. You pretty much always want to trust them. Believe me. Oh, that one's a little high on the zone. We'll take that. We one count looking for a fastball here. He hangs one, and then we hit it super high up. So, a solid inning. We got one run, but time for our pitching staff to come back out. Oh, who is this? Dwight Powell. Oh, Dwight Powell, what are you doing, buddy? Man took a uh, basketball, took it off season. He said, I'm going to play a little baseball right now. First is going to be a ball. We've actually thrown too many first pitch fastballs, so he was sitting on that one. We're going to go uh, fastball outside. Some good location on that. We're gonna go two seamer outside. We got a hold of it. Deeper Berto's right there, though. Easy throw to first base. We got our first out of the inning. Up next is Bud Griffin. Man's got a heck of a mustache. A little high and outside on that one. They're pretty much sitting on a, a fastball each time, so we got to chill on that one. Uncle Joey, though, has got to pop out. Fielding's a little bit difficult in this game, I'm gonna be honest. Whoa, a little. A little mischief out there in the outfield, but we're okay. And then Colin Marino is going to come up here. We're going to hit him with a two-seamer right up top. Oh, that was a strike. Come right back out here. Let's take that foul ball. 
Only have one uh one strike. Oh, we might hit him. It was a prank. Ray and Maz gonna be up now. Trying to get a little run going for his team, a little bit of a rally. First pitch strikes are not uh working for Morin right now. Just hit right down to Clellan over his head. Jones is trying to get it. Tracy Jones, get it in, please. They're going for third base. They're gonna end up getting that one. They got runners on the corners of the diamond right now. With two outs, Morin cannot give up a run right here. This is not gonna be good. Veritable Duran is gonna be up. We're gonna mix things up and go uh slider here, bring it back inside of the plate. That one's to be popped out. Tariq Armstrong trying to get to it. It's going into foul territory. Armstrong's there. But it's a little bit too far outside. A lot of pressure right now. Going two seamer on the outside. Perfect strike. Curveball back inside. Hanging that one a little bit. That one's going to be popped up. Mo Frazier is there. The catcher, the captain of the team is ready. And Mo's got it for out three. Speaking of Mo Frazier, she's coming up right now. Opportunity to try to get some more runs on the board for her team. See if she can get a nice little single, a double. Or honestly, an out. Hate to see it. All right, Nick Payne's up to bat. Oh, he's got one. Drills in the middle. No chance to get to that. We might go for two here. A little risky. Dwight Powell's instead of field. This man's got a cannon. Okay, we're safe. Got a guy on first base. And who do we got up to bat? We got Tariq Armstrong, the first base, who's got a whole lot of power. I believe in you, Tariq. This is your moment. Pitch comes in. We got a horrible one, ladies and gentlemen. Look at the flick of the wrist. That one's not coming back. Get yourself a hot dog, whatever you need. Tariq hit it out to the deep center field. This one's free. My poet didn't even know it. What a shot by Tariq. Beautiful play, beautiful hit. And just like that, we got two more runs on the board with our pitcher coming up. Our pitcher look though, crazy power, literally no contact or speed. We're gonna swing power here and see what he can do. That's why pitchers pitch. They're not great hitters. Tommy Watkins is now going to be up here for the Swordfish. And, uh, well, he is using the first team. But as the pitcher, I don't really feel like he's going to be doing that much. Back to back curveballs coming up here. Watkins actually got a hold of one. Tracy Jones is there in left field, though, for the first out of the inning. Dimples Arroyo is coming up. We got a little two seamer coming in here for him. Rip that one. Tracy Jones going back. Tracy Jones making all the plays so far. We desperately need to get one for our guy Morin right here. It's not going to happen. Di Roberto's trying to pause back a little bit. Right field was coming in too. Di Roberto doesn't really know, but he got it for the third out. So Tracy Jones sitting here dangerous. One ball, two strikes. And that's going to be a ground out. The nom school, easy throw there. Got it about two steps and brings up Uncle Joey. Everybody's got an Uncle Joey. Watkins is uh, trying to get his composure back right now. He's losing a little bit. Still a little bit tense. Okay, Uncle Joey, what are you swinging at? Okay, Uncle Joey, we swung with power a couple of times. Has it worked out? Not exactly. JW is back up. This man's readjusting himself nonstop. Dude, he's got here, the third baseman. Trying to make a good play. Hits one in deep right field. That one's going back. That is deep, and that one is going as well. Oh, my God. Another one, JW, 385 feet, second home run, second RBI of the season. Young fellas feeling good. And speaking of good, Trevor and Abner's coming up. Yeah, it looks like a full count now. That one, look, crazy height, going back, but it's morning track power, a little bit underneath of it and no runs this inning. Moving into the fourth, Holly Namsko is gonna be here. We're gonna try to start off with the, ooh, that's, not exactly what we wanted. We're going with a lot of power pitches. Try to assert some dominance, but it has been a struggle to say the least. Uncle Joey's going to dive. He's not going to get to that one. Noms is going to get herself on the first base pretty easily. We start the inning out by giving up a hit. Dwight Powell, the ledger comes up. This man does not have a hit today, however. Lefty's going to deliver in a nice little curveball. That goes down. Tariq Armstrong nearly had a web gem right there. Going back here with the fastball. Solid placement. Gotta love it. We're going to try to see if we can get him a strike out here. Swing. Oh, we almost went. Let's go uh, curve ball just below. Got a hold of that one. JW was ready, though. A chance to double up. That's actually a little bit inaccurate. The runner comes back to first base wisely because Tariq Armstrong's got a cannon on him. Bud Griffin's going to be up here now. We go with the fastball inside. Got him a swing or got him a check that one. That's going to end up being a strike. More power coming back here. This one's actually going deep. This is the longest ball they've hit so far today. That one is gone. 
and out of the stadium. The first runs that Morin has given up with a Bud Griffin with a two RBI shot to right center field. Alan Marino is going to come up trying to capitalize on what his team has done so far. Morin goes back a little bit more finesse on that pitch. Misses on a little bit. D. Roberto is going to have that one. A little penalty here for accuracy, but it doesn't matter. Second out of the inning. Brian Mad coming up. Going back with a change up. Got him. Finally. Another strikeout. It's about time. Mo Frazier 0 for 1 today. We got to get some to go with Mo Frazier, okay? The captain of the team needs to put something up. And finally, I hit right to center field. Dwight Powell feels it gets it in a second, but it doesn't matter. Mo Frazier is going to be on base. Nick Payne coming up one for one. Had a nice double earlier in the ball game today. See what he can do right here. It's a hold of one. Turns on it. No chance on that one. That one is in the gap. I'm seeing some runs scored possibly here. Actually, Mo Frazier, we're going to hold her. Ended up at third base. A little bit afraid of Dwight Powell's arm, but that ended up being pretty trash. So you probably could have got an RBI there. Here it goes again. That was where he wants it, but I think that's going to be an out. It is. They're going to double up at second base. And now there are two outs with a runner potentially strained to the third. Unless the guy who had a home run last at bat. Tariq Armstrong get a nice little hit here. I up, hits it down the middle. That's going to extend our lead now to three runs. Another RBI for Mr. Armstrong. You got to love it. The pitcher is up now. Look, he's got power. I feel like a home run is going to come at some point for him. No contact, but all the power in the world. No one man should have all that power. That one goes off of the second baseman's glove. That one's going to end up going all the way over uh, to home plate now. We get runners in the corners with Tracy Jones, the leadoff batter, who doesn't have a hit quite yet. But it's fine. We believe you, Tracy. I mean, Wack is starting to get a little rattled now. And, well, Tracy Jones bailed him out. A high pitch we swung at. It didn't pay off. Veritable Durant is going to be up here in the top of the fifth inning. Starting with a curveball. That one's going to be popped up. Tracy Jones trying to get over to it. Set up a 10 underneath that one. And Tracy Jones is the first out of the inning. I mean, Watkins, the pitcher is up. And uh, yeah, no chance this man gets a hit. Zero chance, I believe. Nice little strike to start. Coming back with a strike again. Got him a swing and miss. Got to love. Let's go curveball outside of the zone. Amazing. 99 power. JW with the gun from third base. What a play by the third baseman. Brings up Dimples Arroyo. He's trying to get his team back in this game. Ooh, gotta love that. Great placement on the changeup. Coming back again with another one, but the ump calls it a ball. We would, however, disagree. Nice little shot there. Tariq can't make it. Trevor's gonna try to throw the runner out at first base. But he's gonna be about five or seven steps late, but still a good effort. Two outs with Dub Patrick coming up. He is 0 for 2 on the afternoon. Trying to get another run for his team right now. And the slider back in 99 on that one. Gotta love it. Going curveball here. 99 power, but the aim was a little off. They're going to get their runner over to second base now. Trevor's going to throw it in again, but runners on first and second. Two outs, and all of a sudden, I feel like a rally might be starting. All right, fastball high and in tight. 91. Uncle Joey! This is going to be thrown home. It's going to be played the play they are going to score. So now it's a two run game. And the legend Dwight Powell is up. No Dwight Powell slander. No Dwight Powell slander at all. First pitch is going to be a strike. Second pitch. A little outside. We'll take that. They might have been predicting that one. I mean, right back at it with the changeup. That's going to be a swing and a miss. Gotta love it. Going curveball. We're going to try to set it right inside of him. Perfect placement. That was going to be foul. I think Tariq Armstrong's got this one. Tariq! Gotta get that friend. No, Dwight Powell comes through in the clutch. They're going to get another run to cut it down to one. But we got him out of third base. You know what? He got the run. We gunned him out to stop any more bleeding. This is bad. You've got to do something big in this inning. Uncle Joey. Can you get a hit for me? Can you get a hit, Uncle Joey? This is it. Fifth inning. Got to start it off strong. Uncle Joey. When I said strong, I meant by getting a base hit. You've popped out like every time. Uncle Joey, what is happening? JW's back up. This man has two home runs, two RBIs. All he does is hit home runs so far. Good eye there in that first one from JW. High fastball hits up the middle. It is not a home run. It is a single. We'll take it. That one's inside. Nearly hits Trevor. This man's wearing glasses. Don't hit him. That could shatter. They go for the pickoff play game, but JW is too fast, too furious. Vin Diesel. 
right back at it that probably should have been swung at it is going to drop it's a single trevor's first hit so far this season and we got guys on first and second with only one out here comes mo fraser a single earlier in the game would love to see her put one in the outfield here for a single or maybe even better you hate everything right now you hate everything. that's not most fault it's not most fault and here comes nick payne two doubles on the afternoon so this guy's was all about extra bases at the moment give her something good whoa a little pickoff play okay a little trickeration i see you nick payne we're honestly really late on that one. we're trying to get tommy Watkins up out of the game so he's got five run runs you almost hit the pitcher on that one that one's gonna load the bases again dwight powell's got a cannon for an arm we are not going to challenge that one we're gonna see what we got bases loaded with justin di roberto chance for a grand salami here gotta respect the man wearing shades like that at any point in his life i respect it takes a good ball there the first one Watkins comes back that one is ripped that one is going deep that is off the wall that is nearly a grand slam we're gonna see two runs score we now have a three-run lead di roberto comes up big and now the guy with some of the best power on the team three armstrong a home run a single and three rbis can he get some more right here honestly i'm gonna say no because they gunned him out of first base it's not his fault but still we got the runs we needed we need our pitching staff to hold up here we're gonna come right back here with the slider see if we can put him away he cannot jw nearly has that one but he cannot get through it so close and they get another runner to start out here early in the game and a fastball low that one another one beautiful another hit one. out of our reach now they got two guys on with nobody out and mad is going to come up now he's used to high pitches so we're going to try to keep high pitches away from him that's one of the perks that he has we'll change up trying to keep everything down and away going for a double play here so far so good we got two outs a runner on third right where we want to be we just don't want to give up a run this inning that's really our only thing we're focused on I said we'll strike to start go we'll strike again inside got him a swing uncle joey should be an easy throw at first base got him no run is given up for the first time in a while it's about time now our pitcher's coming up we could technically pinch hit for him i'm gonna give him one more opportunity to bat before we really you know what we should have pinched for him he's done after this inning i think i think we'll let him pitch one more half inning for his next at bat that comes up we're going to essentially get him out here gracie jones has not got anything today and that continues maybe swing at the first pitch is not a good idea tracy i'm sorry two outs now uncle joey can you do something anything please you took a ball i'm proud of you uncle joey second one uncle joey gave it a ride that one however went to dwight powell's house he's out the pitcher is still in the game right now tommy watkins has done nothing okay I was, if they didn't pinch it for him they're crazy bob power slide is going to come in incredible name bob incredible mustache and not an incredible at bat good luck have fun go back to the bench a change up third strike out of the game that man's trying to break a bat most i think he struck him out twice actually trying to break a bat and uh it does not work for him at all anticipated that one jw can't get to it and bud griffin's gonna get back on base he has had tyler Moore's number pretty much the entire night so far only got good placement we're gonna go back where we went that's wild i um i'm challenging that that was definitely a strike he swung in my opinion wherever right you want to be want some finesse here all three however inside fastball i believe sit him down but they're going to take power slide out obviously because he's pinch hitting they bring in rick singleton who uh velocity is good junk and accuracy are trash so we probably are going to be okay here jw again a perfect day two home runs a single and two rbis he's locked in so he's ready to go again whoa we got a sidearm guy that one again it's it's mentally difficult to see that but jw two singles two home runs gotta love it trevor in abnett one for three with a single on the day if we can uh get something deep form that is literally blasted out of the stadium it almost hit the hot dog back there trevor what a shot first home run of the season for him two rbis now and knocks jw in it's time for mo frazier to try to get another hit right now no pressure on mo we got a five run lead team is feeling great right now fair ball actually 
Maz was trying to throw out Mo Frazier, but she's got a little bit of wheels on her. She ends up being safe there. Nick Payne again locked in. Two doubles and a single himself. See what he can do here. Little high, and it's right to Dwight Powell. He's not going to drop anything. He's Dwight Powell, the greatest center fielder of all time. That one split out to right field. Right fielder's got to jump on it, and that one's going to be called for the second out of the inning as well. Another one coming in. Little high, fouled off. No way he gets that. Closer than we thought. On one count now for Armstrong. Got a hold of one. Unfortunately, went literally right to Dimples Arroyo, and that's the end of the inning there. Dwight Powell coming up. He's been the bane of our existence so far today. No Dwight Powell slander, though. Nick Payne trying to chase it down. Feels like he's got a good beat on it right now. And that one, first out of the inning. Right where we wanted it. This is the guy that has been the toughest part of today. Home run a single, some RBIs. Again, the catalyst for the Swordfish today. Get a nice little strike on him. Coming right back at him. I'll sit right to DiRoberto. DiRoberto's got it easily. We get the second out of the inning. Almost done with closing out this inning. Kyle Marino's up. Two singles for him today. Nice little ball. Good strike. I don't mind this a bad so far. Armstrong's going back, looking for it. He's got it. That should be the third out of the inning. On to the ninth. Actually, I don't know how to tell time or what inning we're in because we're actually in the eighth inning. We're in the eighth inning. I'm going to let Morton stay in. I know I said I would pull him out, but I wanted him to ground out the shortstop. That's what I wanted to see. That's what I wanted to see. Tracy Jones, one for four. Tracy, please. I believe. Okay, okay, Tracy. In the gap. Finally, our leadoff hitter finally gets what she needed. A double. He's going to try to stretch it at three. They're going to throw that one in. Noms is going to throw it all the way to home. But Tracy Jones, the first triple of the season for anybody. And here comes Uncle Joey. Anytime now, Uncle Joey. Literally anytime now. Inside. Whoa, they call that a strike? Okay. Okay. How dare you call that a strike against Uncle Joey? Singleton's trying to settle back in. Does it inside again to get the second ball. Falling behind in the count. Uncle Joey, looking a little lethargic on that one. Uncle Joey, if it's height that matters, he's got it. Now, we're going to be able to steal here. Or not steal, but tag up. Dwight Powell's going to throw it in a Nomsko. Nomsko has no chance to get it in. She's got a little bit of a noodle for an arm. And we're going to see another run giving us 10 of the day. JW has got to hit every single time he's been up. Except for this one. We jinxed him. So, Bray and Maz is going to come up. We are actually going to go ahead and substitute... Uh, we're going to take Morin out. He could go for the complete game, but honestly, we don't want to waste him too much. So we're going to bring in Ingle McCringleberry. Brand new pitcher. He only has two pitches, but he does them both pretty well. I jinxed him because he just threw one for a ball. And another for a ball. Third time's a charm. You Roberto. No. Okay. So McCringleberry, we jinx you. I'm sorry. Up next is Veritable Duran, who is... uh. Uh, not had a great game. This one up the middle here. Uncle Joey's going to try to get it. Gets over to first base. He does get the first out, but now a runner is in scoring position. Again, Swordfish are down a whole lot of runs. They're going to take Singleton out and put in Rory Lowe. This guy has a ton of power. We don't want to really mess around with him too much. The Kringleberry's right there to get it. Second out of the inning. And the side. guy on second base doesn't move. It's all up to Dimbles Arroyo now, who's not really that great at getting RBIs for his team call a ball on that one and we would beg to differ we're throwing a little bit of a wild pitch here nick Payne's are trying to get to it can't quite get there this ball is going to end up going to third they try to send their guy home and they get the run okay they're down five runs no way they come back right ringleberry struggling a little bit d roberto's trying to find out where this one's at thinks he's set up properly he got the out and ladies and gentlemen the first game in cobra's history is going to be a w did you doubt him you probably did we're going to walk out of here with a 10 to 5 victory. 16 hits. We gave up 13. We'll work on the whole pitching thing, you know, throughout the year. But solid game overall. Let's see who the players of the game are again. Morin gets the, the start, gets the dub. Eight innings pitch, 11 hits, given up four earned runs, four strikeouts, one home run. Not that bad. And the Kringleberry, some work to do in the bullpen, but he was fine. Player of the game was J.W. Clellan. Four for five, two home runs, two RBIs, and four runs scored. Tariq Armstrong, our second place finish there. A home run, three RBIs, and a run. Trevor and Abnett, a home run, two RBIs, and two runs. The team is legendary today. If you enjoyed it, the thumbs up button. See you guys in the next one.